a little bit of a long time since I posted because various things have happened, like Christmas. <laughs> um, I think I've posted since Christmas. Have I posted since Christmas? I don't know, I can't remember. Um, my memory is useless at the moment. Thanks, hormones. <laughs> anyway, um, really weird. Um, one of my videos from before Christmas, um, which was about the castor oil, like just completely blew up the channel, which is absolutely amazing. Um, and I was just, I'm so thrilled and humbled, you know, by getting so many subscribers. It's, I don't really know how to describe it, but it's, yeah, it's, re it's just really weird. <laughs> just for that one video, which is kind of a different video from what I normally share because I've been talking about doing lots of different stuff like um, sewing and making other stuff and going on adventures and challenging myself and everything. Yet yeah, that was the one video that that everybody seemed to um, love, I guess. Um, but I'm still going to do all those other stuff. Um, but because of this thing about the castor oil, I figured, well, maybe I'll share some of my other favorite like beauty products or alternative health that kind of stuff so today i thought i would show you the one thing i've been using a lot um lately and that is almond oil and i i bought this one from costco actually it comes in a set of two and it's not expensive how much should i pay for it maybe maybe 20 euros, maybe something like that. I don't think it's more than that for two bottles. Um, yeah, more, probably around that, but you can get it, you can get a cheap one or you can get expensive ones. But I bought it because I always used to get shaving rash when I shaved my legs and my armpits and like bikini line and stuff. And I thought, well, maybe I should try something else rather than using like shaving foams, shaving gels, all that kind of stuff. So I started using almond oil. I literally just um, put a little bit in my hand and then put it on my legs or wherever I'm shaving. And I shave, rinse off. My legs are already moisturized because of the oil. And literally from day one, no more shaving rash. Best thing ever. I absolutely love it. So I've been using it religiously ever since. Um, I'm also using it on my face um, most evenings with the castor oil, which I mentioned in the previous video. Um, because the castor oil is really thick and a little, it's not sticky, but it's just really thick. So what I do is I put a few drops of the almond oil in, my, in the palm of my hand and then um, a drop or two of castor oil, mix it all up and I just slather it all over my face um, because... This castor oil is like a miracle. I mean, as you saw in my last video, and if you read a lot of the comments as well, um, a lot of people have been using it for various things like bruises and scars. Um, the, the spot thing that I had on my head, which turned out probably not to be a sunspot. Um, it's got another really weird word like, should I even try and say it? Seborrheic? keratosis I think it was something along those lines I know I'm saying it wrong um but this got rid of it totally the only thing that's left is a very very faint mark on I don't know if you can see it very faint mark on the forehead where it was but the actual um, lump itself has gone and that was because of the castor oil and since that I've been using those two mixed together put on my face um, if I have scars, I'd be using that now because of what people have said. Um, mosquito bites, um, any kind of bites, castor oil. Um, and then almond oil is just super for everything else. And I'm, I'm really loving it. And it's so nice not to have a shaving rash anymore. Um, so I highly recommend that. Um, literally just straight up on the legs. And also it's really good, even if you're not shaving and you just need a little bit of extra moisturizer, um, before you fully dry yourself off after having a shower or a bath, um, just put a load of that on and you will feel so moisturized. It's amazing. And obviously it's, you know, totally natural. So it's really good for you. Um, I don't actually know what else it's good for, but I mean, it's almond oil. It's got to be good for all sorts. Um, but I'll keep you posted on that one. 
but that was it i just wanted to share another tip that i do all the time that is really amazing and also i wanted to say thank you for subscribing because like i said i'm i'm, I'm just over the moon with with all this you know um attention i guess so thank you and i'll be back again soon